Hi, I'm John with Valley. Today I'm going to show you how to add a new user to Base Station 3. Log in to Base Station 3. Now you have to log in with administrator credentials to do this. But once you're logged in, go to the upper right, select the gear icon, and select Base Station Settings. Under Base Station Settings, once that's open, go to the User Profiles tab. And on the far left, you're going to see every user that's already set up in this base station installation. You'll also see the Add New. Select that, and on the far right, we're going to enter their credentials. We're going to add Steve today. Steve Tester. So enter the first name, enter the last name, and if you have more than one farm set up in this base station installation, this is where you would select which farm they have access to. It can be any single farm or it can be all farms. In this case, we'll give them access to all farms. Then, below that is where we can select what level of access he has. We have four different levels of access in here. Administrator, contact only, monitor, or operator. Now, to find out what each one of those roles can do, just select the link to the right that says Role Privileges, and they're spelled out here. Now, the username, the username can be anything. Uh, just should be something that it's going to be easy for that user to remember. We'll make one up, and below that, we have to enter that new user's email address. This is important because that it's important that this email address is correct because this is where they're going to get their password to log in. I'll enter mine. And enter that new user's telephone number. This would be the number that uh, they would get text message alerts from in Base Station 3. And if they have a second phone number that they want to add, you can add that. Once you're done with this, entering this information, hit save. Once you hit save, Base Station 3 is going to set up that new user and send them an email to the address that we entered above. That email is going to have their username and their new password. So with that, they are now able to log in and start using Base Station 3. Thanks for watching. For more information or if you have any questions, contact your local Valley dealer.